is finally in the Hall of Fame like he's deserved for 30 years. Um, I'm glad that they did it before he passed away like they did the snake. But Tom fucking Flores finally, finally, finally is part of the Hall of Fame. And he is so deserving. And obviously, you know, let's hope he gets enshrined as a Raider. I don't think he's going to get enshrined as a Seahawk. Or I think that's all he coached. But he played quarterback for the Raiders, you know, coached the Raiders to two Super Bowls, two Super Bowls. And it took him this long. The man's 83 years old. He's been out of the league since the 90s. Are you kidding me, Hall of Fame? Are you fucking kidding me? You waited this long. It's almost as disrespectful as what you did to Snake. It really is. I know that more than likely Charles Woodson's going to get in as well. And I that was a no-brainer. But to hear that Tom Flores has made it in... I I can't stop smiling, even though I fucking just work like a 14-hour day. um, God almighty, he deserves it. And he's part of the radio, too. He was part of the radio forever. I just, I'm so excited for Tom Flores. I cannot wait to watch him as well as Charles Woodson. I think both of them are going to get in the hall. Well, we already know Flores is in. I don't know if Woodson has been announced yet, but that's a no-brainer for him. Um, But... (laughs) I, I can't be more excited for Tom Flores. I just, I can't. You know, it's it's just unbelievable that he finally made it in, but it's also unbelievable that it took this goddamn long to get him in the game and get him in the Hall of Fame. I mean, he's won two, he won two Super Bowls. First Hispanic coach to win two Super Bowls. I, I, I mean, come on. Why was he not in? Why was he not in? It just shows that the Raiders are always going to have a stigma against them, and it's bullshit. And I know the Raider Nation is flying high right now with, you know, him getting in. I I can't stop smiling about it. It's so awesome that he finally made it in. He deserves it. I hope they get a video of his reaction when they told him. It's just, oh, I just, I, I, it's almost, I hope that he gets as emotional as Jimmy Johnson did when they did it for him on Fox Live because that was that that brought a tear to my eye when I heard when I saw it. I mean, I just Tom Flores in the Hall of Fame. Finally. So every coach that's won a Super Bowl for the Raiders is now in the Hall of Fame. So let's get Gruden in the Hall of Fame. Let's win a Super Bowl with Gruden now. And let's get him in the Hall of Fame. Cuz I don't think he's won a Super Bowl before. I don't remember him winning a Super Bowl ever. Can't say that I remember him ever winning a Super Bowl. I'll have to look back on it, but I don't think John Gruden's ever won a Super Bowl. Don't think so. No, I don't think so. (laughs) I'm such a dick. But Tom Flores, congratulations. We love you, coach. So happy for him. I know everyone's going to be blasting out videos, but hopefully you guys watch it. If you haven't subscribed yet, subscribe to the Bigger and Brighter Sports Network. Late-breaking Raider news all the time. Um, but yeah, Tom Flores in the Hall of Fame. Hell yeah. Uh, congratulations to the old ball coach. I know that's Steve Spurrier's nickname, but fuck it. We'll give it to Tom Flores too. The man's 83 years old. I cannot wait to hear that speech. Cannot wait to hear that speech. So we'll talk to you guys soon. Remember to like and subscribe. And as always, let's go fucking Raiders.